Aufbau für Schönberg. Nicht nur Schönberg. Good. Now you're in blues, now we push, now we push, all in. I said, please, now I left it. It's cool. <laughs> right, I don't know. Well, pink, but that was only time I learned, but <laughs> they were just, I just wanted at the time. We just click. That's what it was. That's what it was. It was a great partnership. I believe it was the best partnership I had at Coding Club Club because we had a one there's Coding Club Club, but we were a good side. And he had tell you himself that we were dangerous with both, both ends of the boxes. So we kept them out there, but we were able to get them on the other end as well. And I guess they say, we used to tip, we used to tip all the players away and I used to score them. <laughs> I'm not asking honest. Like I've vlogged the night and said, I'm proud of what he's done. I haven't got the chance to say that, but I'm saying after what, 16, 17 years? How proud I am and I've kept the name while he's doing his process, but there's no better man as there's all he gets. Because I loved every time I played. Gareth, what was your time like here? Okay. Listen, I was, a, I was a young one. Well, not really that young, but I was a young one in, in terms of the, the, the dressing room. I was saying to them, like, Paul is a relaxed character, if you like. So it was really good for me to play with him because um, he was able to just, just maneuver me through games, help me through games and stuff and that. There, but all around, all around us, we had had experience. Jerry Flynn on, on our side, Sturry on the other side, things like that. There, you got McCush, McAllister, uh, I mean, all, all, the, all these names are massive around Irish League that I had the pleasure of playing here, but they. As a learning experience for me, looking back on it, it was probably the best learning experience until I hit Roy Hodgson and then he took me to another level in terms of knowledge of football and stuff and things like that there. Uh, but um, yeah, I love I, I to hear playing here and the, the, just saying the, the experience in the Irish Cup final and winning that, that, that Irish Cup final as a, as, a, as a young kid and stuff and that there was... Uh, it was amazing to be able to share it with these players. And that was my only medal. <clears throat> also, like you know, Paul's talking about there, you know, him, him watching your career going on with pride, you know, knowing that there was a lot of people that played with you that were cheering you on as you sort of progressed into, in the, over in England and I said, into the Premier League. Yeah, well, I, I always felt I was representing them as well. Um, you, you don't do you don't do things on your you don't do things on your own. There's all, there's always people that have been there. There's always people that have helped you. There's always people that you've learned off and stuff and that there. And Paul and the, and, the, and the rest of the players here and, and Marty and the, and, and the club and stuff and that there were, you know, were great to me and they're all part of part of my journey and all part of what made me successful, if you like, and, and things like that. So it's not one of them things you, you just. We started talking about the partnership and stuff, but we just bonded. Yeah. We just had we just had that bond, and we just able to play play well together. There was players I couldn't play with throughout my career and stuff like that. There and other other players, and you, you just you just you kind of know what they're going to do. And, um, yeah, right, well, that's how it worked really well. We, I mean, that season as well, we went twenty two games on beating. And the, and the thing, I'm at, at one stage, we could have done we could have done the league title as well. So 
maybe that's a disappointing thing that we didn't do that but you know, it's called, we'll, we'll take it and cherish it and uh, finally any palatable stories of your time together with each other palatable remember we're there's children going to watch this behave yourself we'd, all, uh, we'd always get nights out that's yeah, we <laughs> did we had, no, a, we had a good so we had a good a, a good team a good social uh, thing as well but we we, no, we, we just bought it hard, didn't we? the well. whole team was the same it's it's the, same thing. It's the two years I spent along with we that's probably the two best years I've had at Korean Football Club as a player but that's because the hand there beside me was, was fantastic because we both I, I know we both scored 34 goals in Tunis in the two years of there and that's a, that's a lot at centre half I, I, it's nowadays you won't get there as much now you got the most of them <laughs> but it's not because I, but we, I enjoyed his, I was so laid back he'd say to himself and that probably helped him a bit because see we just won't play here and we'll knock it to the guys in front of us so that's all we do give it a packet in front of us and Sturdy was probably laid back more than I was and Jerry was the same so we were basically and, and, Big thing, big man behind us, baby, was great for us because he never stopped. To be honest, but I'm telling you, and he deserves everything he gets. I'm proud of it. I was part of it, the journey. So, and I'm glad I've seen him now for all this time. So, so. round corner, back, uh, in the back. I was covered. It wasn't the top corner. It was, <laughs> <laughs> it was scuffed into the back. I was, I was covered. Come on. It was 30 yards. 